Hey guys, so today I am going to show you guys my skincare routine. Um, I've gotten a couple requests for that, so here we are. Um, I actually was talking to my mom about it today, and she said, um, you're going to have to tell them the truth that it's your genetics. So here I am telling you it's my genetics, which is not true because the second I veer from my skincare routine, all hell breaks loose, and it's like I'm 14 again. So uh, I'm going to just show you what I do in the evening. Um, the morning is very different, but I think the evening is really like what does it in because if I don't wash my face or like do all this before I go to bed in the morning, like I said, it's like I'm 14 again. Like I just completely break out and it's just not good. Um, so first you gotta tie your hair up and then you gotta get a headband so your hair doesn't get stuck in your little face scrubber. Okay. And I just use these like cloth headband things because then if I do get makeup on them or whatever, I just wash them in the washing machine. Like I just got makeup on this one. Anyways, okay, so first we're gonna wash a face. Bet. So many reasons for you to be happy So many reasons for you to be smiling But you're not about to see them You're not about to feel them You're not about to be them uh, You don't believe them So many reasons for you to be angry So many reasons it's not the way you planned it But all you can do is see them All you can do is feel them All you can do is let them be Life happens while you're making up the plans Life happens while you're trying to understand You'll be kicking it in the shade and you're thinking you got it made Life is gonna happen to you anyway Life happens Life happens yeah. We're gonna wash your face And to do that I use this scrubber thing It's got black stuff in it because the um, wash face wash I use is black. And I use, I actually just got this as like a little sample with some of my face masks. And I'm going to buy more just because it smells good and it makes my skin not break out. But it's this L'Oreal Pure Clay Cleanser. It's probably full of a bunch of chemicals, but right now, after um, having Tyler Grace and then breastfeeding and then stopping breastfeeding, my hormones are like all over the place, and so I break out like that. I'm not a skin like expert. This is just what I do, but you'll just like get your face damp. Okay, makeup gets all over it. So again, I'm no skincare expert, but I just put a little bit of like hand soap on there. My tube for sugar and wash it so that I can get all the makeup off of there because it just doesn't rinse off. But if I use a little bit of soap, it does. So I don't want to just be putting it back on my face. I don't know. I don't like it says, and I'll say this probably a million times in this video. I don't know if any of this is true. This is just what I do. So then I just put a little bit of this black stuff on here. Not that much. So like this thing has lasted me like a couple weeks already. Just because it's just a little bit. Then scrub, scrub, scrub face. And 
Now, this part, then you gotta like wash this thing again. Um, this part is my favorite because I feel like I'm in like a Neutrogena commercial, just not as graceful. Um, the girls, you all know what I'm talking about, don't even pretend. That's really hot. That would be fun. There's still like makeup that came off. I did not wash my eyes. So. Because that's a whole different can of worms. Okay. So, now my face is washed. It's beautiful. And then, we are gonna get this stuff. I don't know even how you say it, so I'm not even going to try, but this cleansing water, I don't know, it says even removes waterproof mascara. No oil, alcohol, or fragrance. Shake it up. And you're going to get two of these. Because I'm weird and I don't like to use the same one on, um, like, I won't use one on one eye and then use it on the other. I don't know. You just never know. You might have, like, I don't know. I feel like you would know if you had pink eye. I don't know why you wouldn't. I don't, I just don't. Anyways, you get all around the eyes because you didn't get around your eyes with your scrubber because that would be horrible because that skin's super sensitive. Then you get the other one to the other eye. And I have an eyelash in my eye now. Okay. There. No, everything is clean. Yuck. And that's why you shouldn't sleep with your makeup on because that's just sitting there. Ugh. Okay, so that's done. Now we use the magic stuff. I think this is like my favorite skincare stuff. I had my eyes on it for a long time. Um, just found them on social media. This brand is from Australia, and um, I never could, like, get the guts to buy it because it was a little bit more expensive. Um, and it's technically face tanning water. Um, but then they started selling it on Amazon, so I didn't have to pay for the shipping. And the shipping was what got me because... I mean, I could have like $100 in my shopping cart, but if you want to charge me $6.99 shipping, I'm not ordering it. Um, but with Amazon Prime, it's free shipping. So I ended up getting it, um, I don't know, a little while back when I decided that my skin was looking a little pale. Um, but again, you get one of these. And I use these a lot. I use probably, let's see. Four, five of them a day. Um, so I do buy them in, at Costco. They have them there. So that's good. So you just take this and you put a little bit on here. You don't need too much. I guess that was kind of a lot. And then I move it around so it's not all just in one spot. And then I just rub it everywhere and it does have um so 
in the United States, they can't market it as, like, acne because there's not been, like, the science experiments. I don't know. Whatever they need to, like, say that it's for acne. Um, but it has, like, helped, I think, with my acne. And... Um, it says... It won't block your pores. It's all organic, so that's the part that got me. Like, the first ingredient is aloe juice. Anyways. So, the what I was getting at was, it says on here, non-comedogenic, I probably just butchered that, anti-aging and anti-acne formula that brightens and evens out complexion. Um, when I got it, it had like a sticker over that. Um, so I think that's because they can't say that in the United States without having all the testing. But, um, it definitely has like evened out my skin tone after having Tyler Grace, like my cheeks get really red. Um, I even get like red splotches on my arms and, um, it's really helped a lot with my face. So I do that. And then sometimes if my skin's feeling really dry. I'll wait about an hour after putting this on. And then, like, right before bed, I'll put some of this hydrogenous. Or Clinique makes the same stuff, and it's more expensive, but it works the same for me. So I just get this L'Oreal brand. And I've actually, like, discovered I really like L'Oreal stuff. Um, they It does pretty much the same as, like, a lot of Clinique stuff does. Makeup, no. No. You have to buy good makeup. But I mean, for like hydrating gel, it's the same thing. Um, anyways, so I'll probably put this on in about an hour. Um, the only other thing, maybe 30 minutes. Um, the only other thing I do for my nighttime like routine is bleach my teeth. I do that maybe two or three times a week. Um, and that's it. That's all there is to it. I think I'll probably do a morning skincare routine a little bit down the road, but I think the nighttime is like where I do the most good because in the morning I'm really just putting makeup on, which is probably not the best. Um, but anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this and it was educational. If you have any questions, put a comment below and don't forget to subscribe. And I'm actually going to put a link for the Amazon to order this so that you guys can all get it because I love it. Anyways, good night.